heroes wear capes. All you need is the intention and will. What is the reason for this? Our Supreme Buddha showed us the path that leads to happiness. Namo Buddhaya. You have now come to the World News and the Buddha's Great Message Session where we read the news that has happened around the world and see what lessons we can learn from these news from the Supreme Buddha's teachings. My name is Thir and today I am here with Amasha. A video that has gone viral on social media features a student who did not leave his injured friend behind in a classroom when everyone was evacuating during an earthquake. His kind and thoughtful gesture as one praises online. Let's see the video now. Not all heroes wear capes. You don't need to have some superpower to help someone. All you need is the intention and will. Our great teacher explains how merit will welcome you in the next life. A man who has long been absent and has returned home safely from a distance is welcomed with joy by relatives, friends and well wishes on his return. In the same way, his good deeds will receive him who has done good when he goes from this world to the other, as relatives receive a dear one on his return. Therefore, my dear Dhamma friends, don't be afraid to do deeds of merit. This is a synonym for happiness that is desirable, pleasing, charming, dear and agreeable. That is meritorious deeds. Namo Buddhaya, my name is Amasha. We like to wear beautiful clothes, listen to beautiful songs, play video games and eat yummy food. What is the reason for this? Because we like to be happy. But these material things do not give permanent happiness. It gives happiness for a short time. The happiness that we find from these material things are impermanent. Let's see the news first. University lecturers, librarians and admin staffs across the UK will strike over pay and pensions. The University and College Union, UCU, has announced a total of 70,000 UCU members at 150 universities were asked to vote in two separate ballots, one on pay and working conditions and another on pensions. Our Supreme Buddha showed us the path that leads to happiness. There are four kinds of streams of merit that generate happiness. What are these four? 1. When a noble disciple of Buddha has unshakable confidence in the Buddha. 2. When a noble disciple of Buddha has unshakable confidence in Dhamma. 3. When a noble disciple of Buddha has unshakable confidence in Sangha. 4. Precepts that they protect in their lives, virtue. Therefore, my dear Dhamma friends, accumulate as many merits as you can and escape from this endless samsara. We'll see you all next week. Hello, Ansara and I, Namo Buddhaya.